guys, it's Wisteria, and welcome back to another Animal Crossing Dreamtown tour. Now, before we begin, I would just like to ask you guys a couple of things. As you can tell, if you've watched my previous Dreamtown tours, you can tell that some things are different. I'm using the bottom screen, and I also have the in-game audio on. But I would like to know if you guys prefer me to do it like this, with the bottom screen and the music from the game playing, or if you like the old way better where it was just the top screen and I put my own music overlaying the video. But yeah, let's just go ahead and get into the Dreamtown tour. So the town we're going to be visiting today is one of my fellow YouTubers' towns of Squishla. Squishla belongs to Cassie Crossing here on YouTube or Crosser Cassie on Instagram. If you would like to give her a follow or a subscribe or whatnot, but yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. So here we are in the town of Squishla. It's very beautiful. It's another spring town. I do believe she has her own town tour of this town if you'd like to check it out. It looks like we have some outfits lined up for us back there. Um, I'm a little conflicted because technically my character is a boy, but I always dress them like a girl. Uh, we'll just go ahead and go with the girl outfit. But I guess we can go ahead and show you guys what's on the other side as well. Okay, so let's see what we got. We have two presents to open here. Let's see here. A Roman candle and a vanilla soft serve. Oh, I kind of want to hold that. That's adorable. Let's go ahead and put on the outfit as well. We have a pink lace dress. Ooh, that's very pretty. With the hair bow wig. Let's put on our ballet slippers and white stockings. This is so cute, aww. Okay, and then let's see what's laid out for the boys too, just in case you're curious. We have a blue cap, a blue striped shirt, gray formal pants, and hiking boots. I'm not sure what's on the other two presents, but yeah, all these paths around here remind me of my paths in Windhelm. I think I have the same ones. We have beautiful pink and white tulips around with some gems, very beautiful. I'm seeing some mushrooms over here. Oh, look, it's like a little fairy circle. How cute is that? Gotta take a picture with my character's scary little face. <laughs> I'm so glad I finally have the face I wanted in my Animal Crossing series now. But yeah, I love this path. It's like, it reminds me of Princess Peach. I don't know why. And here's some peaches to fit along with that with this beautiful bell. Uh, I need to put my ice cream up or I'm going to end up eating it. There we go. <laughs> Then over here, it looks like we have a lighthouse, very nice. And then the fairy tale clock over here. So as far as I'm aware, I don't think this town is hacked or anything. I'm not really sure. Let's go ahead and go this way now. See, I kind of like having it like this because you can see the map, which is good. But if you prefer just the top screen, just let me know. We have a lot of flowers over here, cute little butterfly flying around, and the campsite. That's very beautiful, and a lot of bamboo. Then we'll go around this way. I think actually we should follow the path. Oh, I'm trampling on flowers. I promise I don't do this in people's real towns, just in their dream towns. I'm just constantly stomping on all the flowers. We have a fairy tale street light right there. And let's go, hmm, let's go up first. We have a sign that says, please walk. It's definitely good to have a reminder. We have this cute little fountain right here. And then up here is the train station, which is the fairy tale train station. Very nice. A couple of bushes. I didn't know you could grow the bushes this close to the cobblestone. That's cool. And then uh, I kind of am afraid. Yeah, see, I would have missed this. There's a little drinking fountain right here. Very cute. And the illuminated clock. I've been wanting to get that for solitude. I think that'll look so good in solitude. Uh, we have a villager's house right here. Let's see who it is. Chevre, I think. I don't... I'm bad at pronouncing things, as you guys know, but I do believe that's the cute little goat. We have some violets over here with the town hall, which is also the fairy tale design. We have a cute little squishla flag. Oh, and then we have the standee, which is the same one as the one in Windhelm. And then back here we have the cafe, of course. And I don't think I'm missing anything, hopefully. <laughs> I'm always afraid that I am. Uh, I kind of skipped the path a little bit. We'll try to get back on the path now. Let's go this way. Is that Chevre's house? I think so. And then we should have another house coming up over here. Let's see who lives here. 
We have Francine, very cute. I love Francine. And then let's go down here. We have some perfect apples there. Cute little heart stump, very adorable. And the tire, little toy thing. An illuminated arch with a little pouch under it. Let's see, did I miss anything? Hopefully not. Oh, I think I did. Okay, let's go up here. There should be some player houses right here. Yep. Okay, so let's go on in here. I'm not saying the villager outside just yet. Ooh, so in here, it looks like this is kind of more of a storagey area. What is this thing? I don't know that I've seen this before. Weird. Actually, there's a lot of new stuff. Oh, are these like pins? That's very weird. There's like office supplies in here. Very strange. Never seen that before. Oh, here's the villager. Let's talk to her. This is Vanny or something. Uh, pronunciation as always with me. You can never expect much from me, okay? Vanilla is always better. Oh, so is this like a vanilla and chocolate type of thing? That's really cute. Let's go ahead and go in this house, which does look pretty chocolatey. Oh, the villager was back there. Oh no. We'll talk to her whenever we leave. It's fine. Oh, and here we have a lot of the Hello Kitty set. Very fancy, very cool. I really am a huge fan of the Hello Kitty set or the Sanrio sets in general. They're just so cute. Okay, so let's talk to this villager over here. We have Choco. Chocolate is always better. Okay, so that's cute. We have this nice little bench in between their houses. And then Retail is right over here. Oh, I'm getting stuck on the bushes. <laughs> Very cute. I love all the items around. This reminds me of a little cute fairy town. We have a little wishing well down here. Let's go back over to here. And I guess we'll go down this way. I don't think there's anything we missed. And then it looks like this just kind of loops around back here to get to the campsite and whatnot. Okay, so I think that might have been everything on this part of town. So we can go ahead and go to the lower half. Oh, we have Gail here. Oh, I love Gail. I have her in Windhelm. Uh, over here we have some nice little perfect apple trees. I love the shells on the bridges. I've been seeing that a lot lately and it's just so cute. Um, oh, over here we have, I don't remember what this sculpture is called. Is it the arch sculpture? I don't remember. It always reminds me of a big tooth. <laughs> so we have that right here surrounded by a lot of pink and purple flowers that come in off a little bluish. But they are purple. And then we have another villager house right here. I guess this is one that you take pictures in because we have the little Instagram logo in here. So let's go ahead and give this house a visit. Oh, and here we have a lot of the mermaid set and the princess set. Then let's go downstairs. Ooh, down here we have the ice set. I love the ice set. It's so beautiful. And then let's go to the room up here. Ooh, up here we have a lot of pictures of the villagers and a lot of cute balloons. Very adorable. I love the wallpaper that you have in here. That's very nice. Oh, the villager's actually in here. Hello. Aw, she's so cute. This is Sarah. Have a blessed day. Aw, she's so cute. Okay, so we're back out here. I hear some footsteps around. I don't know who it was, though. <laughs> oh, there's somebody back here. It looks like a villager. Probably the one that lives here. I'm not sure. Amelia? Yeah. I think I saw a bird. Yep, that's Amelia. Oh, I see a fairy tale bench over there. I think I must have missed that. And let's go down over here. We have a villager's house. This is Peggy. I like the house. It's very cute, very pink. Here we have a um, wind turbine, right? I don't know. <laughs> and then the illuminated heart. And then over here we have the classic police station. I like the bushes near it. That's really cute. And then right here... We have Freya's house. She's the pink wolf, I believe. Okay, so let's go ahead and go back this way. Let's see, this is the sculpture again. And then we have another villager's house right here next to some cut bamboo. This is Gail's house. We just saw her. Is there anything back here? We have a cute little stump and the hot springs. And a lot of bamboo and trees with a flower arch. Very nice. Oh, I kind of skipped past here, didn't I? That's okay. We have a bench right here. And I guess we'll go around this way, kind of go backwards a little bit. Over here, we have another villager house. Let's see. This is Gala's house. We have another villager right here, which is Cassie herself. I believe in you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> She's very adorable. We'll go into her house in a minute. Right here, we have the flower clock. And I don't remember what this is called. But it's very nice. It reminds me of like a little altar or something. And then down here leads to the beach. We have a lot of flowers and presents down here. I just love how like 
I don't know, is busy the right word to describe this town? I just, I really like that. I like it when towns are just really full, really diverse in what they have in them, if that makes sense. I don't know. <laughs> here we have Apple's house. Apple is very cute. And we have a little chair right here. And then here is Cassie's house. We have the flower arch right in front of it. Very cute. Oh, look, the little pink castle. That's so adorable. We'll go ahead and go inside. Ooh, this is a very fancy room here. We have the princess set and, like, the little birthday song is playing. Hopefully you guys can hear it. Sometimes the music is a little bit hard. Like, it's a little quiet, so it's hard for my microphone to pick up. But, yeah. Let's go ahead and go to the room on the right. Ooh, and here we have a lot of the sweet stuff. I love that cat tower. It's very cute. And these little donut chairs are adorable as well. Then let's go to the room up here. Ooh, this is a very pink room. Oh my gosh. I didn't know you could customize lovely stuff like that. That gives me an idea for my houses in solitude. Might have to do them in that style. That's very nice. I love the wall too. It's just very cute. Very cute. Okay, and then let's go to the room on the left. Ooh, and here it looks like we kind of have, like, a kitchen, I believe. Very cute, very cute. I like the little marshmallow chairs around the dining room table. That's adorable. And those are some cute outfits, all. I actually really like the yellow one. I'm not usually a big fan of yellow, but that was adorable. Okay, and then in the basement, oh, it looks like we have some of the Sanrio set. Very cute. I love the My Melody stuff. So much. It's just so adorable. That clock back there is really cute too. Aww. I guess that's custom of the Regal set, I think? Not entirely sure. I'm bad at remembering what furniture's from what sets sometimes when I don't own the set myself, if that makes sense. Then let's go to the room upstairs. Ooh, up here we have some more of the Sanrio set. Very cute. And some of the, um, uh, what are they called? The things you get for um weeding day that's what it is <laughs> i really like that bear that's very cute and the peeing statue is on either side as you enter the room very fancy <laughs> okay so i think that's all for this house all right so now i think we need to go this way we have another villager house this is poppy's house very cute and then who lives here oh yeah this is gail's again okay so did i miss anything i kind of feel like i did let me do a quick walk around just to make sure. Yeah, I think that was everything. Hopefully I didn't miss anything. So yeah, guys, that was the town of Squishla. I love the town's name. I think that's so cute. But I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you did. Oh yeah, also, if you have a town or know of a town that you would like me to do a tour of, let me know. But yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.